Good afternoon guys. Today I'm making leftover chicken. It's called chicken curry. I already made the curry by myself. I'll show you guys later. But the leftover chicken. This is the leftover. The what should I do? I just need an onion, a little bit of garlic and one ginger cube. I show you guys later. And easy to done. Put the pan on and put the olive oil. This is the olive oil. It's from Syrian. It's from Syria country olive oil. I try this one. They said it's much better. I think it's nice and very nice and original olive oil. And uh, hot pan. Put some olive oil in there. And I just doing the chicken now. Make a small slice. Take the bone out. There we go. You don't need to use knife. I use my bare hand, my sexy hands. But you need to wash your sexy hands. And then I use my hand to take them slowly, slowly put pot. Turn the pan on. Fire is on. That's my curry. I made it by myself. And um, I tell you someday, another day, some another day to how I make the curry. But you can use any, any already made it curry from uh, market. Or you can use the like a, like a curry powder or anything. Put little bit more oil and put the chicken and the ginger garlic ginger cube i don't put garlic i only put ginger cube in there put the all chicken is in there and put the garlic as well there we go start it now just mix it. I just a little bit fried it in, in oil. When it's warm, then I put start put the curry in and put the onion in. Because the onion is very quickly done. I just need to warm up this chicken. Cover up. Sorry for dirty the kitchen because I, I don't have a time to clean it. I cooking fish head as well, but I already t tell you guys how to cook it. The fish, steam fish heads. I buy the salmon head today. I'm cooking these as well, steaming them. And uh, the steamer is on. I put the garlic ginger in there. This is my favorite steamer. It's on. And I'll keep them to the in. But the main problem is here. Here we go. Let him warm up. The chicken is when, when we started. And then we do another stuff. It's raining day. I love raining. But not dancing in the raining. Just, just the natural rain. I love it all. There we go. This is the curry. I made it. This is all olive oil. And it's not dirty oil. I never use another kind of oil. There we go. You can see the ginger cube is melting down. I already crushed the chicken. That's enough, the small. You can put the peas in there, you can put the chickpeas in there, green peas in there, anything you like it. But I, I don't have a green peas today. I don't put any green peas. I put onion in there. That's it. This, this curry is middle, mild curry. In the middle, like not spicy, not too spicy. Mild curry.
the only thing I put it in later a little bit sugar in there a little bit half teaspoon sugar this make the spice up there we go I done boo-boo there we go I need to two hand to take this put it in the curry I show you where. that's much curry you needed to put it in now I need to mix it up before before you guys put the water in you need to warm this curry up and smash them because it's, if the curry is not be warm enough this they not melt it down in the water but just make it smash it like that and when it is broken warm enough and then you put water in cold or hot water any kind of water I put the down a little bit to get water about one pint of water and now put it in first half glass put it in mix it up see if you need more water but first let the curry put the fire up let the curry to warm up because it's going thicker if if it's too much thick you put more water in now i need to sorry i need to cover up now to make the water warm up there we go there we go is is warm enough now and as you can see it's very thick put left water if you want to put more water you can do it now onion time with the nice onion you don't need to hurry with the onion onion is very quickly the day just we, we need a little bit onion on in a tough tough side that's why I put onion in the last we need more water because this curry is very thick that's enough there we go now need to mix it up and close the lid I just need to mix it up water I don't want a curry we be stick under under my pan there we go cover it up and voila that's it and I show you guys later there we go that's it it's cooked perfect nice curry that's the perfect nice chicken curry leftover curry and I show you guys how to do the the next you put the little bit coriander on the top thank you guys thank you for watching my youtube channel please like and share love you all bye